<laughs> You're not leaving. Hey guys, we're live. Wave to everybody at home. Hi guys. <laughs> Do you want me to get the um, broom? Okay. You guys, I want purples um, on your outside and your roll down bars. Make sure your straps are on. We need a half roller. Let's take a measurement. And we're gonna do roll down. So that measurement is you're gonna sit down and see where your tailbone is. And then I want, um, I want your tailbone right on the front edge. Did you guys saw, say hi to everybody at home? Yeah. Hi guys. Hi. Okay. And let's just start roll downs. I've got some ice water over here so you guys know what's going on at home. That's okay. Okay, I raised four kids, so I am like. So you know that you just go to next to one here. You're all good. Yeah, you've got two. <laughs> okay. Let's you. just roll down slowly. And pull back for three. Once you're there, all you're out. Pull back for two. Pull back for one. Hands go forward, shoulders down. And slowly... Rolling back up. Press the bar all the way down. And for the tailbone up, stack up one vertebrae at a time. Good, pull on those hamstrings, get a good stretch. Let's roll down slowly one vertebrae at a time. And pull that bar down once you're down, all the way down for three, two, and one, hands go forward, and slowly roll up one vertebrae at a time. It's still a little bit wet, Pie. Just be careful. I just don't want you to slip. So are you. I'm good. Press all the way down, and stack up slowly one vertebrae at a time. If anyone goes walking through, just watch your step, just because it's still got to dry a little bit. Good. Go on. Go on. And go again, rolling down one vertebrae at a time. Good, keep your legs on, pull back for three, pull back for two, pull back for one. Good, hands go forward, make it harder than it is, resist and roll back up. I thought we were full, we did have a cancellation. Good, and again, roll all the way back slowly. We're gonna add on this time. Slowly pull back for three, all the air out. Inhale forward big, pull all the air out two. Inhale big forward, pull down one. Let's hold there, let's just touch right below the rib cage. I want you to tighten your lower abs like you're zipping up a tight pair of jeans. And from there go into a slight bend. So allow the springs to lift your ribs up. Good, if this hurts your neck in any way, don't do it. Hold for three, hold for two. Hold for one, chin in, ribs in, bar forward, shoulders down, resist and come forward. Good, I wanna see everything shaking. Press up and over, press all the way down, pause. Use your core to stack up. Okay, I want you to stay right here, pull your toes back and stick your tailbone back behind you and just give your hamstrings a big stretch. Everybody feel it? Okay, from there, we're gonna tilt, and let's do horseshoes, roll down that right side or left side, whatever side you're on. Slowly roll down, so the arms are almost straight, and let your head touch, and then rock it over to your opposite side and roll back up. Beautiful, keep the hips nice and solid because your core is on, we're warming up that core, warming up the ribs, warming up the spine. Nice, and take it over to the other side. Nice, abs tight and roll back down. Breathing, smiling glutes, smiling face. Good, and resist and make it harder than it is to make everything shake. Yay, good. And right back down that same side, make it harder than it is, keep those legs on. Tilt to the other side and come up. Good, go right back down that same side. 
And this next time we come up, we are gonna do eight crunches. So these are small movements, holding there. I don't want you to bounce the springs, I want you to crunch the springs. So right in those obliques, keeping both legs, and just come halfway up and back down. It's almost like you're pulling your ribcage deeper into your body. Tighten that pelvic floor. Imagine you got Frankenstein bolts in the size of your glutes, bolt them on. And then eight on the other side. Vicki, you didn't know we were going live? You said something about it. <laughs> <laughs> well, did you do this every Yeah. It's so much easier for me to do it live, and then they're um, uploaded, and all I have to do is put them in the playlist, and there's all those new videos up for oh. people. It's just our, like our members who are home. There's 52 members, but we did have eight join us yesterday. Bless you. God bless you. Um, but they're not... They're not watching a video to watch you. They're watching a video to listen and go, go on. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know. She hasn't convinced me yet. <laughs> <laughs> and if you want, you can always grab a back machine unless it's a night. 4.15, the back machine's reserved for Dally. But you don't come at night. Okay. From there, let's drop this bar down. So I want you to drop it down. If you are tall to the hole, if you're a little bit shorter, about two inches below the hole for the 100. Now we're missing Nancy today. She, went, she didn't want to come in until the end of the week. You're going to take and put your feet through here and curl your cleavage of your toes around the bar. You want to on this no, you can get rid of that half roller. If you want to try it with a roller, you can. You've been on the roller enough, you could probably balance it by. Right, Jackie? You could probably balance it, too, if you wanted to do the roller, but it's tough because your hands aren't grounded and your feet aren't grounded. Okay. Okay, check the cleavage of the toes. When the cleavage wraps around, that's exactly that measurement you want. And then I want you to bend your legs in the tabletop. Squeeze your inner thighs as tight as you can. Good reach up and grab that bar. <laughs> Bring your bra strap down so your bra strap is grounded into the mat or your bro strap. Good. Push those legs out and away. Turn zip and wrap. But if you start to feel your lower back, bend them back in. Here we go. Inhale, tap. And exhale, two, three, four, five. And in. Turn on those VMOs. And exhale, squeeze your inner thighs as much as you can. Good. Squeeze your glitch, you guys. Good. Straight legs, really reaching to those metatarsals. Turn on those VMOs. Hinge up high. Smiling glutes, smiling face, toes are apart, heels together. Point to those minutes. Are you cramping? Okay. Okay. Make these muscles right here work, those VMOs. Squeeze the back of your thighs together. Good. Straighten those legs even more. Squeeze the back of those thighs. Good. Bend your knees in for a moment and... Take your head down, keep, a, keep your bar, and rock your head. No, side to side. I think you just cheated on all of us. What? Do you want like 30 more? No, we did. We did. Did you guys do 100? Oh, yeah. Okay. Toes go cleavage on the other side of the bar, cleavage on the opposite side. Good. I want you to pull with your feet and get a lower ab contraction. If you can tease her up, tease her up. Good. And back down. Oh, and hold the bar. And hold the bar. Oh. Tease her up. But keeping the bar here. Yeah, keep the bar down. Good. I'm going to bring your feet down and tease her up. Come all the way up, 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 up. Oh, oh that's right. Does it hurt your back? It's okay. Okay. Then, it? Yeah, just don't hurt your back. You're going to oblique it soon. Are they? I hope. Yeah. I'm sorry. Eight of these. Do <laughs> you think it was one? No. <laughs> I did about four. Okay. 
water. Good job, Lenny. Good, good. Good, you guys. Teaser. Okay. To get eight of them in. Right on. Uh, is it harder if I put my up here? It is, and it takes a lot of hamstring length. But it is because it, it gets a better lower traction. Yeah, wow. looking at all together. Okay, from there, this bar is going to go up for mermaids. Now, if you are a shoulder person where your shoulders are cranky, I want this bar just eight inches from the top. If you are strong, a shoulder arm person all the way up. Okay, so now if I wanted to make this harder. Um, all the way up. All the way up, so it gives me more of a pull, mm -hmm. right? Okay. It's harder to go down. Mm -hmm. Harder to go down. Harder to go down, easier oh. to come up. What? I can't. We're, it's a mermaid, this thing. That's what I can't do. Decide that and it will go up like this for the second one. All Stay right. here for the first one now. Okay. Okay, gotcha. legs are bent, feet are on the front bar. Okay. So feet here, knees yeah. together. Do you still love me, Vicki? <laughs> <laughs> right now I'm not happy. <laughs> we go on the bar and grab your bar and go right up overhead to right here. Good. Eight. Yes, eight. So go all the way down, touch your elbow down. Good, and now control back up, keep that top hip still and crunch. Good, chin lifts up, go back down, pull the rib cage in, nice and deep, good. And control, and when you come up, make the up slow, then the down. Drop both your shoulders, like have a beautiful scarf flowing down your back. Or for today's world, maybe we need a superhero cape to flow down our back. Total control, more pelvic floor. Don, I'm going to make a note right now about 9 o'clock. And then just remind me as we get to summer that you, 8 o'clock. Okay, just keep me posted. Off on Friday, if anybody wants it. Friday. Jackie, you are in for Friday. Yeah. Work out twice as hard as you get. So Eleni gets the workout too through you. Okay, flip to the other side. You know, it must be an emotional day because not only we have your water going, the water over there is dripping. Really? Yeah. Is that what it is? is yeah. It's emotions. It is. Mm -hmm. it's 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 I, I spilled a whole pitcher of water all over my cabinet this morning. Yeah. <laughs> it's understandable. We got some stuff going on. You guys make the up slower. <laughs> um, I tell you what, if my toilet's running at home, I ask myself, what am I over emotional about? Okay. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> so, yeah, tell us when we turn it off. <laughs> I, there's a lot going on. Okay, if you're a person that needs help on this next one where our legs are straight and you feel like in that long switch you can't lift yourself up, I'm going to show you on pies what you can do. Take these and just go, it has to be on the inside. Go up. If you go on the outside, it's going to make a horrible noise. It has to be on the inside. Okay. Inside. Okay. This is based on in Vicky's direction. We're going to be hip on top of hip. Do you want the extra help? Okay. What do I need to do? Wait, wait. So this is going to get harder if we go up here? Or well, you go it's going to make it easier. You're good at this. Okay, thank you. Absolutely. Okay, facing the front door. Top leg is back. Hip height. Wait, so is this hard going up? Pop hard on back. You want down. You, you lift up. Yeah, you lift on. Yeah. If you don't lift up, that's why we put it up. Okay, top right. foot goes back behind you. Hip height. This one. Top leg. Switch. Oh. Top leg's back. Front leg's forward. Or bottom leg's forward. Mm -hmm. Hips are stacked. Good. And you want that hand facing down. So face that hand down. There you go. From there, mouse house your waist. I want you to look at your top hand. 
Keep it there. Keep looking there. And lift up, whole torso. Up and mouse house back down. We're gonna do eight of these. The more you look up towards that hand, the easier this gets. Not that it's ever easy. Good. And then keep the hips stacked, one on top of the other. Good, and come back up and mouse house down. Oh, and smile glutes, smile face. Did that help, Pi? Yeah, it's still hard. I'll get it. It is. It is. Okay, after eight, you're eight. We're going to flip to the other side. Good. Top leg is back. Go up onto those toes, really reaching. Mouse house the waist. Good. And lift up. That would get much easier if it's on the side. So that means you need hip releases. The hip release yeah, on my tidbit on the on yeah, the yeah, YouTube yeah. channel. Go to tidbits, and that's where that hip releases. Oh, you remember? Yeah, yeah. Every day before you get out of bed. Sandy, yes. Why is it that I can come up or clutch on my other side? I cannot even lift myself up. It's the same thing for Pi. You have one. Whatever hip is lifted. Like this is always my lifted hip. So this side's really easy because I'm already in a contraction. This side is, look at this long, long extension. So a long muscle is a weak muscle. A short muscle is a strong muscle. So one side's gonna be easier than the other to have hips that are, one hip's higher than the other. So I could do three and then it just starts to go. Okay. Hips, hip stack, Lainey, don't let that right hip or left hip open. Look at your hand. So yeah. You want to be your hips oh, yeah. like this, correct? Correct. And come up. Yes. Yeah. Is it because she's long? Why well, does she do that so easy? She's got that long, beautiful waist. Oh, and it's part of it. And it's yeah. Beautiful. But the more you stack it, the harder it is. We can it. see it, too. It's on camera. Come on. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, <laughs> okay. Okay. From there, we're gonna go a bent arm measurement. So I want you to lay on your back, your head's gonna to be towards your straps. The elbows are at a 90 degree angle, your shoulders are at a 90 degree angle. Okay, from there, feet go into long straps. Make sure you're centered so it's equal. You want to see what I was doing last night? Oh, um, we haven't done that in a long time. To open up the lower back. Mm -hmm. um, we can do it here after this one. Okay. Okay. So feet go in straps. Good. Hands go back on the bar. But instead of gripping the bar, let's go open hand squeeze. So hands on the bar. You're going to scoot that way a little bit, Donna. Good. And I want the hands up where your forearms are parallel. Elbows are in. Shoulders are down. And now don't grip the bar. Make an open hand push. So you're pushing with open hands. Shoulders down even more. Hide your rib cage. Put a small gap in your back. Draw down and control up and keep the small gap in your lower back. Good. And again, draw back down. Good. Let's do eight of these. It's going to lift you. It's going to lift you up. Those hands just help you ground that tailbone. So the tailbone's heavy. There's a small gap in your back. Where's Buddha today? How come he's not helping you? He's in the Throwing him, he went to sleep. Buddha. He's sound asleep. He is sound asleep. He Buddha. Sound asleep, don't wake He's got one ear. Oh, we're we doing Pilates? Mm hmm Pilates stance, squeeze the back of the thighs. Don't let your tailbone move. My nose becomes flat when I get here. Your, t your lower back does? Don't. Yeah. Would you say, Pussy? This is as far as mine's right here, it switches. Okay, try that. Anybody else having a hard time keeping their tailbone down or not squishing their? Vicky, you feel good? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go out to the width of the machine, or maybe one inch wider. Draw down and around in the circles, and I want you to watch your springs, that they are smooth. Don't let your springs get wobbly. So it means you're moving with purpose, staying muscled, and moving slow so that your springs don't have any wobbles to them. 
Just bring an awareness. You might have one side stronger than the other. Just bring that right strap down a little bit so it matches your other one. There you go. Five of these. And then medial rotation direction. So that means your toes are turning in. Your knees are trying to look at each other. Draw down to the center, out about an inch wider. Bring the big toes towards each other. Maybe touch them. Watch your windows and draw down. Ooh, Vicky got a shake going. Elbows go in. Good. Palms pressing in on the bars. Perfect. I figured out what I'm going to do on my birthday, or my birthday, I mean my Christmas money. I'm going to go see Pam in Durango. It's <laughs> very good. It's been a year and three months since I've seen her. You look great. Yes, you do. From there, let's go. And let's, okay, I put you, you're up in the circus. Forget the video camera. Now you're in a circus in front of all these people. You're on a tightrope with a big clown bike, and I want you to pedal balancing on this tightrope. And we're going to go forward for eight. Good. Elbows in. Open hands. Pushing in. Use your abs. Keep that small gap in the lower back. So you're stabilizing in that neutral. Okay. And then reverse. It's smooth, you guys, because if it's not smooth, you could easily fall off the tightrope. More abs. Go backwards now. There you go. Go all the way to straight leg. Straight leg. I mean, that way your abs really have to work. So go down, pedal backwards. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Go all the way down the straight arms. So meaning that you got to push your body down like you're doing an overhead press. I'll go up one for you on here. Height. Straight arm. Push so, off. Go all the way down. This is still gotta go. Yes, yeah, so your hands are all the way down at the bottom and go all the way straight. The straighter your arms, the easier this next move is. Go all the way down. All the way. Hands go down, down, down. Oh, here. Yeah, now push all the way out. Straight arms. Good. Okay. From there, bring your heels together, toes are apart. Bring your legs all the way down, and this will lift you up. So allow it to, yeah. I want a straight line from your ankle to your shoulders or your ears, okay? So it's a nice straight line, tightening your glutes. Okay, staying low. Get those hips all the way up, and you're staying here while I'm talking to you. Lift those hips. Oh, Push this down more. Yeah. Lift your hips up. Eesh. Even more. Right there. You okay? Backwise? Okay. Now from there, tiny little circles. Oh, wow. Tiny little circles. Get those glutes even more. Open those hips up. Make sure you're not in your neck. Draw your scapula down. Get those feet down in here. Good. There. That's where I want those circles. That way you're not in that neck either. Go one direction in the other direction. Vicky, is it hurt in the back? Okay. Will you call me? Okay. Are you sure? Vicky, you all right? Fine. Okay. Call me and let me know you're okay. Okay. This is my personal space. Yeah. But my life. And I feel like it's violated. Okay. So we'll talk. So I want to talk. I'll make sure it's right for everybody. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye, Vicky. Vic Vicky, if I turn it off, will you stay? I can turn it off right now. Okay. Little circles. Good. You guys got both directions? Yeah. Okay. So we're going to slip the straps off of your feet. Good. And let's do push two bars. So in the back, I want you to use one red spring. If you're pretty tough in the shoulders and pretty strong, Donna, red and blue. Maybe Vicky needs to start being over there. Yeah, we'll I'll talk to her. 
She's um, she's upset about the live. We used to video and we haven't videoed since COVID. And so I think everyone got used to not videoing and now we're videoing again. So it's, you know, no, no. And it, Dally's the same way. She said, so that's why Dally gets the back machine. So, okay, feet go wide, hands wide on the bar and you're gonna face the back of the machine. Go one, one red. And then feet are wide, and I want you to sit nice and tall. Good, hands are wide, pull toes back. Good, and lean all the way back with your sacrum. Drop the shoulders down, push down and through. Keeping your hands tight around the bar, keep the wrists straight, don't let the elbows bend. I mean, it's just a tiny bow, push down and through. Good, drop your forehead down and get a good stretch. Wow. Feel that stretch? Drop that forehead even lower and slowly roll back one vertebrae at a time. So slowly rolling back, one vertebrae at a time, shoulders down, bar goes up, and press up and lean forward and stick your tailbone back behind you. Good. Slide back, so shoulders slide down. Roll like you're putting your sacrum down on the mat. Shoulders are down, push down and through, keep those hands closed so that I know that you are safe. Push all the way down, hands closed, and drop your forehead down. So this is a round back. Pull your toes back. So pull, pull, pull. Good, slowly roll back. Good, like you're gonna put your sacrum down on the mat. Control the up, taking the bar up. Lean all the way back, all the way back, all the way back. Press up, chin up. Feel me pulling on your tailbone. Bone. Feel those toes pulling back. Slide the shoulders down, over-exaggerate. Lean all the way back, so now you're C-curving. Lean all the way back, get that sacrum down. Shoulders down, good, wrists are straight. Push down and through. Good, drop your forehead down, but don't open those hands. Keep those hands closed so I know that you're safe. Pull those toes back. Good, slowly roll all the way back, all the way back, all the way, shoulders are down. See how it wants to push you around, Jackie? Try to use that core to use it. And use that core, arms go up, make everything stack and shake. Arms up, flat back, push all the way up. Good, tailbone's back behind you. Good, shoulders down, lean all the way back. So leaning, good, try to get that sacrum down, shoulders down, push down and through. Good, and drop your forehead down and get a good shake, stretch. Last time, roll all the way back like you're trying to get that sacrum down behind you. Don't let it pop you. Beautiful, you guys. Push all the way up. Flat back. Good. So flip, go flat back and hold right there. Nice. Take your right hand off and grab your left bar with your right hand. A little bit of a saw stretch here. Push up and let it twist you. Push the arm up at the same time. Good, switch arms. Push shoulders and get a great stretch. Push that right arm all the way up high. Hi. Is that that shoulder? Yeah, be careful. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Good, and then um, hold your bar and spin yourself around so your feet are towards the roll down bar. We're gonna do teasers, we're gonna do teaser progressions. So there'll be one teaser, you'll say, okay, that's enough. Donna, you're good with all the teasers, so you'll progress all the way through. So it just depends on your back, but I want you to come down until your neck is directly under the bar. Go bar goes up, scoot all the way down. Yeah, go bar all the way to the ceiling, straight arms. And your neck has to be directly under the bar. Oh, okay. So they're up here. Yeah. So when your arms are straight, your neck is directly under the bar. Bring legs in the tail. So, Lainey, your neck has to be directly. Oh, go arms straight. Lay down. Good. And see how your neck's way up here? Mm -hmm. I want your neck underneath the bar here. Good. And shoulders down. Yes. Legs and tabletop. Squeeze the inner thighs. Inhale here. I, then I want you to lift your head and look at your navel. We're gonna paint a line from our navel through our quads to our shins and lift up in the teaser. Donna, is your neck directly under the bar? It looked like you were higher. 
I am tired. On purpose? Stay, stay, hang there for a second. Idiot. Okay. And from there, bend your arms three times. Yeah, it's the perfect time to ask a question. Any other questions? <laughs> then you have to work. Good. And then drop the legs just tiny bit up and down. Straight oh, legs. Oh, oh. Good leg. Tiny, tiny, so you're not getting into that lower back. Now you're going to bend the knees back on the tabletop and slowly roll down, shoulders down. Bring your feet to the mat. Good. Press your legs out. Bring the bar to your nose and shave the top of your head. And stretch. Nice. Good. Bend the bar past the nose. So lift the legs in tabletop to be easier on your backs, unless you're Donna. And lift up. And the T's are turn, zip, and wrap. Holding your upper body perfectly still. Bend the elbows down. Inhale, exhale, up. Inhale, exhale, up. Inhale, exhale, up. Drop the legs a little bit and lift up, lower abs. Lift. Lift the legs. Good. Give it attitude. Bend your knees in. Or if you want, drop your heels away and drop your head. And your heels and head hit the exact same time. Press the bar above your head and get a good, good, good stretch. Good. Bend the bar down past your nose. Good, look at your navel and roll all the way up. Good, toes apart, heels together. We're gonna add on three elbows, smiling glutes, smiling face. And after three elbows, three legs, that's okay. And then the add on will be arms and legs together. You're gonna bend and drop and lift. So body stays up, bend the elbows, drop the feet and lift up, lift up, yes. And then roll down slowly, bending the knees in, our heels go out, heels and head hit the same time if you're going straight leg, and give it a good stretch. Nice. Good. Pi, how's your lower back? <coughs> okay. Okay, you guys wanna try it from straight leg? Lainey? Okay. I think I did that last time. Okay, I want you to lift your head and look at your navel. Oh, I'm sorry, bring your bar past your head first. Now look at your navel. Good. Paint a line from your navel all the way up those legs. With that painting the line, get your spine to bend, round to come up, come up in the teaser. Look at your toenails and give me attitude. Good. Bend the elbows for three. Keeping the upper body perfectly still. Point the let toes or the feet. And then three legs. Arms and legs together. So bend and lift. Bend and lift. Bend and lift, but keep the upper body still. Attitude. Look at your toes and paint this beautiful line from your toes all the way down to your navel. <coughs> and get a good stretch. Now just hold there for a moment. Good. And hide your rib cage from me. Okay. Nice. And slowly bring the bar up. Good. Come all the way up. Um, now just come up and swing your legs towards the front. Nice. Stand up like you own the machine. Boom. Own it. Nice. You're going to take your purple spring and we're going to go in the center on the outside of your roll down bar. We're going to be pace, pacing the front door and we're going into jousting. Okay. In the center, Donna. Yeah. I like this one. Yeah. This is the Ninja Turtle. Okay. <laughs> As, um, we're doing it. What I want is that your chest. You know what? Because you guys are, I got some tall ones in. I want you on your shorts. Okay. So. Should I stay on this or stay on your shorts? You can go either way. Okay. If you run into something, move your chair. So I'm facing you guys just for a moment, but you are going to be facing this way. When you have this out in front of you, I want your chest open, like you're pushing the chest into this tree that you're hugging. Okay? Am I on the long one? I sure am. It doesn't. It, it, it doesn't really matter because you scoot out or in to make it easier. Bring your outside leg up in the tree. Outside leg? Yeah. Okay. From there, you're going to PK kick. You're going to land, keep your body straight up, shoulders down, twist, pause. 
When you untwist, this is slow through the spine to make your obliques and multifidus work. You're gonna balance, keep the hands right in front of your nose, come up, PK kick, and bring it in the tree. Beautiful, eight more. Remember, if the chair is getting your way, you can slide the chair. Twist, untwist slowly. And right there, Donna, both, both these are bent. So are both these bent? Yeah, I mean, it's like your like, foot closest to the calic will start to straighten, but you don't want it all the way straight. And then come back up, balance. Is it migrating the water? Yeah. My water. I'm sorry. That's okay. What? Shoulders down. Good. And then come out of it slowly. Come up in the tree. It's called jousting. Good. Step and twist. Untwist and come back up. And again, kick and twist. Shoulders down. Nice. And again. Is everybody feeling it? Can we flare our lats while we do it? Relax when you bring the heels back up. You can do these. You know, like this. So if you don't put pressure on it, just soften, and it comes right up. I like it. I like it. The way you look. Yeah. So you know, that's about the awareness pie. Is is when you feel it and you start getting really into your body and that awareness. You know, like when you first came to us and you're like, oh, I'm feeling it. I'm not feeling. It. Now you're all, hey, if you do this. I feel it this way, so that's perfect. So repeat what you said, and then I'll repeat it to them at home. Want me to repeat it again? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I said, you hear that strength, and then you can hear it, and you get just soften. Soften and lift. Really so she's saying strength to press yeah. out, so soften to like lift. This, you know, okay, I'm getting back up. You lose your so soften, soften and then then lift up, up just yeah. slowly in that soft space. Awesome. Soften, and it so it, you up. It does. And, you, and that's that finessing of the machine, like um, driving a clutch, how it all of a sudden starts to become like you know where it's at. Your body, your clutches are, and that engagement. Switch to the other side. Shoulders are down. Bring the leg up and then into tree. Good. Step and twist slowly. Good. And your goal is never to go slack. And that's feeling that clutch. Driving that manual transmission. Step out a little bit wider, and that way um, you won't hear the clunk. Listening to your springs, they're telling on you. And bring the hands down lower. Just so bring the hands right in front of the sternum. Twist. Untwist slowly. Remember that soft and lift. Listen to those springs, you guys. You can't hear them. That's perfect. Good. When you step out, Lenny, with that left leg, PK kick, do a little bit of a lunge into that left leg. Lung, yes, twist. Good, come out of it slowly. Do you guys have any requests today? <laughs> Eight of them? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, you know what? We're done. I've been so sore right here. Yeah, I'm right up high here. Up in there? Good. Yeah, Any years all over here. Any years. Every day. Really yeah. Okay. I don't know what that bad too. I'm used to it. I know. Um, well, I think Monday I'm Reformer, we were doing a lot of that reaching down. I made you like really, really reach because we had somebody new in class. So I was really yeah. focusing on that, Where, pulling yeah. down below yeah. the bra strap. You're gonna take your roll down bar and now hook it down to your lower one. And you're gonna grab your hands on it. You know what's happening. Shoulders are down and we, um, your feet are gonna be hip distance apart. 
your ribs are in, don't let them flare, pull them in. And you're gonna sit back. Sit back, sit back, sit back. Dig into your heels, open up your curl slowly and come back up. Just palms facing up. Okay, from here, slowly come down and curl. Booty back. And then come back up. Squeeze your sit bones if you're feeling your knees. Stick your tailbone, reach back, reach back, all the way back, try to get that chair way behind you. And then come up slowly. So arms go straight. Good. What's that? I sat on this. Oh, did you sit on the pedal? You can depress the pedal of the chair if you want. Give it a little depress. Come back up to those heels. Beautiful work. Good, Lainey. Good. Booty back, booty back, booty back. Open up those arms as you come up to make it harder as you come up. Good. Knees are tracking nice, you guys. Curl those hands in. Straight back? Yeah, straight. Well, Is it? okay. it's slightly it's forward. It's a flat back. How about that? But it's not, it's not perpendicular to the ceiling. Like this? Mm -hmm. Yes. No? Yes. Now, see how your elbows went down? Curl to your forehead. Oh, dance. dance. Shoulders down. Flare your lats. Look at those arms, Donna. Good. Tighten those armpits. Open as you come up. Yes. Well, Donna, how many years of Pilates now? 18. 18. Wow. Shoulders down. And come back up. Shoulders down. Jack, you see how those elbows are starting to drop? Remember, curl towards your eyebrows. Curl towards the eyebrows. And shoulders down. Flare your lats, because I want you to feel those lats. I'm not counting, Jack. I'm just following you all. Oh, I think we're probably at it. Are you big counting? Yeah, okay, do one more. Back up. Okay, how are we doing leg-wise? Okay, I want you to bring it back down, hold it there, and I want you to curl towards your eyebrows. This is called, consider the preacher's curl, because our elbows are up. You're going to be down. You're going to be down the whole time, okay. squatting down. <clears throat> shoulders, see how I'm flaring my lats? So my shoulders are here, not here. Okay. Boom, okay? I'm going to get my hips lower than my knees unless I'm hurting in my knees. And I'm curling in, out. Now, if you can't do it, walk forward. <laughs> Stay there and just curl in and out. It's too hard in your arms. Scoot forward. Shoulders down. Smile glutes, smile face. Can you get in those quads a little deeper? I like it. Make sure on your feet that you're standing in all four points, that you're not going out to the outside of your feet. Your knees, good, are straight forward. What's that? Did you get 12 of them? 12. Good. Okay. Bring down your trapeze bar. And let's bring it out walk over distance. Okay, you should have some sticky mats um, around you. So, Lainey, here's so, yours. Okay. Let me let me um, ask you. Yes. Okay, so my shoulders have gotten so painful. I cannot sleep on my sides. They okay. I can only can sleep on my back now. Can't sleep on my side. So I want you to. Um, you remember my whole thing I did on locates with the weight here. And then we did the agoscu, these, yeah. and then the, the circles forward and back. Oh, yeah. Okay. Do those. So all three of those. The weight, you know, you're holding the weight here. Okay. Okay. Then the aliens with your Thanks. stomach pooching. Okay. okay. 20 of these. Thumbs forward. Squeeze your scapula. Let your stomach pooch. And do these circles both directions. Do you remember that whole series? No. Okay. Um, Maybe I think it was that up. 
I need to record it. And so, I think I've pulled a little tiny. Yes, yeah, so we need to do. Let me, let me do. Okay. Was it your was it your pull ups? Oh, I don't know. Okay. 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 So we're gonna try. Yeah, we're gonna try walkovers. Okay. How do you walk over? How do you get out of it? How, do your shoulders have to roll? Because I don't think I can do it. Um, are you are you out? I don't know where to put it. Okay, so walk over just you want fingertips on one side and wrists on the other. Okay, and okay. and then tighten it. Jackie's doing it. So Jackie, see how she has to roll the shoulders? I'm not sure I can do it. You can do it. Well, well, you just like let go the second you go over. Can you catch me? Go, oh, Jackie. Yes. Okay. okay. Wait a minute. Okay. So you're up here. Now what? Go up. Yeah. That, go up one more bar. Up higher. Your hands okay? Yeah, my hands bring, are all right. Bring one, one foot now. over. One foot over. Which way? There you go. Yeah. That way. Spot and me. put it right here on the bar. Oh, put it on the bar. Yeah. Okay. okay now what? Bring your other one. Good. Walk down. Oh. Just kind of. And then oh. you come back. How That's what I was afraid of. Put that right there. Did yeah. it hurt? Yeah. Not then. I will be done later. So okay. okay so Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, guys. Okay. Um. So for you guys who don't want to walk all the way over, if you have anything going on with your hands or going over, make sure you kind of. I want you to push your hips to the ceiling. Donna, I'm not even have you drop your head and keep your head parallel and just lift your hips to the ceiling. So you would walk here and kind of go into a half back bend. Okay. Now wait, hold on. I wanna listen pie. One, okay, two, both feet over. Three. Slowly walk down. Push push forward. Okay, so you and then you put your feet on the trapeze to come back with one. Then what on the Go into split, yeah. Three and the other leg too? Or no, you just you would just do one. Now what do you do? Switch yeah, legs. Yeah, bring your other leg over. Yeah. Bring it down. Good. Now bring it. I'll, I'll touch right. here. Lost. Okay, touch it here. Now bring oh. your other leg over. You got it. And now walk. Yeah. Hold there. Don't let go. Be okay. Shoulder wise. Yeah. Drop your hips. Oh, oh keep your God. hands here. Your hips shoulders are still okay. Yeah. What push, am I doing? Your, push your hips forward in Titanic stretch. Bend your knees. Yeah. And sink yeah. into that stretch. So you kind of do like, yeah. Okay, that's gonna take me a few times. Okay, listen, guys. I wouldn't take you here if I hadn't. This is what I want to tell you. When we do chest opener on the bar behind us with one blue spring, and we got to push through, and we press all the way back, and we come forward, and we lift that bar. That's when I'm watching you guys. And now that I know that you guys can do that, that that means you can do this. So that's your step to this one. Otherwise, I wouldn't take you over. But if I hadn't watched all you guys with your no um, um, chest expansion is where you push the bar back and roll the bar forward and lift up. So, but you know, for things for the does that make sense? Because look at your position here, and that's what you have to have to come down. You guys all have it. Otherwise, I wouldn't bring you down. Okay. Okay. And um, do one more or just push your hips. Let me see you do it. Okay. How long can you get there? Okay. And get to the top, right? Straight arms. Just hang on your arms. There you go. And walk yeah, up. Top. She doesn't have to be on the top. Yeah, it, has to be. it doesn't matter which one. Oh, it doesn't matter. There. Okay. Ooh, look at you. Good. Yeah. Go feet on the bar if you want. Good. So you can go arches on the bar too. Okay. Come on out. Okay. So it's just kind of a little uh, pause, come down. Does that make sense? Or working on that grip of that left hand? Yeah. Okay. I know. No, you're fine. Switch. No, switch legs. Good. Now walk over. Okay. Now where does it go? Remind me. It stays here. And bring the other one over. Good. And now bring one down. Oh, and then okay. the other. Now I got to get back up. Huh? Okay. No, now use your back foot. Put it on the trapeze after stretch. You want to okay. go over? You feel comfortable with your grip? Yeah, I think so. Okay, now one what? foot comes up. 
And the other one comes up. Good. Step up higher. Where? Right there. Far behind. There you go. Good. And then one, bring one foot. Nope. Work up this way. Bring this leg. Where? Bar. This. Go, nope. Go the other way. <laughs> Whip bar. Go up to the ceiling. Ah. And back behind you. But I'm going to bring you down. I don't know where I'm at. That's okay. Come down. It's okay. No, I didn't. I actually didn't know where yeah. I was at. It, what's going to happen is once you're there, is you got to bring that foot up overhead. You like how she volunteered you, Jackie? Yeah. Okay, Jackie, ready? Okay, up. Up. All right, take off early. One. I forget to put two. Three. Okay, now. Yeah. So you have to use your feet for the bars. I'm trying to watch you. Use your feet for okay, the bars. Now to get up. Okay, now okay, you can now. use your shoes. Okay. Put yourself up. Use the bar for balance. Use the other bar. And then you have the balance. You're really good at that. And then okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, yeah. We'll work on it. Okay, let me use yours for a second. I want to clarify something for you guys and yeah. everyone at home too. Can I use yours? Okay. Um, so the one, two, three is really just one, two because you're here and you're here. Okay? Now, it is a pause and stretch. Switch if you can in the air. Pause and switch. Both feet then come here. Okay? Now, then you would lower yourself down. Oh, Bend the cool. knees, okay, and stretch. Here's your Titanic. Wow. Okay. So pretty. Then you can step up here, okay. or you can just give it a couple jumps. And pop up. Wow. And those okay. will become in the handstands. Okay. Wow. Yeah. So, the, oh. to build up to. yeah. So, Switch. Switch the air. You got it. Two. Yeah. Come on. Over. Yeah. Titanic stretch. You got it. Do it again. You got it. Do it again. Ah, damn it. That's okay. Use a trapeze or come out. Listen to your shoulders. Good. Step up. Step up. That's what I'm like confused. Where am I? Where? Body wise. I don't feel my body. Okay. You're going to go this way. Bring this foot over to the ceiling. Oh, go yeah. Well, how often are you upside down like that? Uh, so it's that, that is body awareness. So right now there's a little dysphoria, but the more you do it, the more body awareness you'll have okay, you'll of, have of where you are. Kind of so instead of a normal stretch, we are going to go in the shoulders, okay. meaning we're going to um, heal them. So I want you underneath your machine, there's kettlebells. Oh. Okay, or there's weights, and oh, if you have weights, grab two of them. Actually, there's, there's some more kettlebells now. Yeah. Donna, thank you. Are you leaving, Donna? Are you leaving, Donna? Yes, I have a an appointment. Yeah. Okay. And so what I want you to do is you're going to put a hand, put your left hand on your Cadillac. Step backwards a little bit. Okay, and then you're gonna bring your left foot forward. So left hand, left foot. Okay, and now we're gonna hang out until you feel your right arm go flat back, Laney, lift up. There, okay. You're gonna let your shoulder relax. Hang here until you feel it relax. Boom, mine just went. Lift up, Laney, there you go. And we're gonna make small circles. This is a PT move, though I am not a PT. And we're doing 10 circles, one direction and 10 the other. Good. Set the weight on the floor. Switch hands, switch feet. Okay, so my front knee is bent a little bit. My back leg is straight. Pick that weight up, come up. Where your back is maybe a little higher than being parallel to the floor. Good. Hang no circles yet. And let it stretch your shoulder out. And you'll feel it relax. And when it relaxes, then do your circles. And then you see how my body's up? Yeah. Bring that hand underneath you. 
Right, right to the edge, right to the edge. There you go. Good. 10 one direction, 10 the other direction. So this is, I know I do a cat stretch for some reason. Flat back, just let it flat back and just let that shoulder pull, but don't let the scapula stick way up. 10 both directions. Okay, then you're gonna take that weight so you don't trip on it, put it kind of close to your machine, but leave it out so we remember to clean them. Okay, and now we're gonna go into Agoski. This is Pain Free Living from Pete Agoski in Delmar, oh, California. Okay, best book ever. I want you to take this whole section from your knuckle to your second knuckle is on your temples. Your thumbs are facing down, so don't be here. There you go, just like an alien. You guys feel like an alien? Read it, that noise, <laughs> yeah. Bring, okay, let your tummy pooch. Pooch. We're looking for an adjustment, so we got a pooch. We don't want any adjustment, we tighten. Don't look at my pooch. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna, okay, from there, Jackie, bring your elbows and elbows out. Now your elbows might not touch, that's okay. But if you do these every day, I promise you, within two weeks, they'll touch. Are you touching too? No. I do something like this at home at night. I mean, all of you are close. Only because I, my mom always, because we're so tall, she's like, no slouching. Wow. How many do you do these? 20. Do you put pressure on your temple? Yes. Keep your thumbs straight down. Good. On my sister because her, sh her shoulders start to do this. I think you guys are tall. Release down. Okay. Let your tummy pooch. Bring your hands straight out from your shoulders. Thumbs go forward. Okay. So I want you to do a thumbs what? forward. Okay. Jam your scapula together. And let your pelvic floor go and let your abs pooch. Good. We're all going to watch Lainey. I hate poochy abs. And go forward. Okay, we're doing 30 circles. Four, five. Make your golfer's grip, Jackie. Golfer, golfer's grip. There you go. Thumbs forward. Scapula. Let your belly pooch. There's sunshine. Sunshine! Hi. Hello! Hi. Yeah. You missed this twirl over this thing. Like yeah. out. Cirque du Soleil. I am okay. Late. No, you're not. Are we done? They're at 10 30. <gasps> go back, go thumbs back. back. Oh you're, the next class starts at 11 45. Oh, that's right. Hi, honey. <laughs> you were hustling for no reason. Relax, take some breaths, get a drag glass of water. 30 of these. Like your tummy pooch. So, hi, see how my palms are facing that? Uh, but, does that hurt your shoulders? Oh, yeah. I have and okay, release. Okay, feel your shoulders right now. Do you not feel like you're okay? So that is your routine. Yes, my routine. Day, hip does, release. How does this help? Because this is what I do tonight. It just opens up and glides your scapula. So you just take a weight and you find something that put the first one and you do these circles. Yeah. And then you put these arms, which is alien. Hard. I know. Yeah, and then Bailey, thumbs yeah. forward, thumbs back. What we do with Bailey? Oh, we did this. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. Okay, shake everything out. Good, give it. Watch what you're around. I'll jump. One big jump for fun. And you guys are done. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, guys at home. Thank you. Thank you. Somebody says, when you're coming out, it's going to say, smoke. Yeah. <laughs>